start with the financial situation. You said on the first day, your first availability, that you didn't quite have a grasp on it yet. So we're about three weeks in. Do you have a, a better feeling on, on where we stand and how we get out of this? Uh, I, I do have a better feeling, and we don't stand uh, in, in very good shape, as you know. And uh, uh, I think we're going to be able to pay our bills through this, the balance of this calendar year. But everyone is pretty worried about what it's going to look like when we get into fiscal uh, 11. We are in fiscal 11, but when, when, when we start dr having to draw on the resources that aren't available to us yet for fiscal 11. And we're also concerned beyond that that we'll lose maintenance of effort protection after, uh, at the end of fiscal year 11 and into fiscal year 12. And that will make us, if the state hasn't dealt with its budget problems, uh, that'll make us very, very uh, vulnerable in fiscal year 12. What's the feeling when you walk into the job on your first day and Walt Norris says, the state owes us almost $300 million? Right. Uh, that's that's got to leave a pretty big question mark. Well, I mean, it leaves a question mark about how we're going to deal with it and, and at the same time preserve the quality of this great university and serve the students and the citizens of the state, sure. Uh, but I, I'm not daunted by it. I, it's, it's just a big problem to be managed, and that's what we're going to try to do. And it may be a little bigger than a lot of other states are facing or state universities are facing, but people in my job in public universities all over the country, to one degree or another, are facing the same kinds of problems. So, How likely is borrowing at this point? I think uh, we, we certainly haven't taken it off the table. Uh, I don't think we're ready to do it right now. We're going to wait as long as we can, because uh, the longer we wait, the more information that we have. And uh, while we can, if we get there and have to borrow to pay the bills, that's I'm sure what we'll have to do, but it's not a long-term solution. And as you know, we can only borrow up to about 75% of what the state owes us. So we have to worry about the other 25% too. We do. We do have. We're putting. We're going to have a very aggressive set of recommendations for cost savings at the university, worth about 60 million dollars. Have come from this report from the ARR. We've established a steering committee. We accept some of these approved and ready to move forward. So we have a steering committee that's going to steer the implementation of these. Most of these have to do with back office operations, HR, IT, those kinds of things. I hope by uh, the start of the academic year we're in place to begin implementing several other recommendations. So I think on, what I can say is that so far as the university is concerned, we're going to make every conceivable effort we can to trim uh, our operational expenses, uh, to manage the cost